right now his protege Landry Jones is going to try to get this offense in the end zone. Chris Brown the tailback behind Matt Clapp and again the three tight ends look up to the sideline the linemen stay stationary. Second down and four to start the fourth quarter. Oklahoma clinging to a three point lead to try to add to it here. Chris Brown cuts inside the five and it's first and goal. The eighth straight run by the Sooners. And while BYU's defense has made them earn every yard, I think I agree with you, partner. They're starting to wear a little bit thin. And this is playing to the strength of this offensive line. First and goal, Brown. This time he's wrapped up again, though. They're not done trying. There's the all-conference defensive end, Jan Jorgensen. Oklahoma tried to go on a quick count right there, and BYU was ready for it. They were not fooled. They were in their stance. They played the play with good leverage, and they came up with a nice stop. Bronco Mendehall, team won 10 games last year, 11 the previous two seasons, and they're giving number three Oklahoma all they can handle. Second down and goal. Broyles and Tennell both split to the top of your screen. But it's Chris Brown again, and Brown goes down again. Oh, a great play by Jordan Pendleton. And he got in there, he made a play in space. Because that looked like Brown, if he could bounce past Pendleton, he would have walked yeah. into the end zone. Pendleton and Clawson, those two outside linebackers, had played a remarkable football game tonight. And remember Matt Bauman, their captain yeah. middle linebacker, went out with an injury early in the ball game. Oklahoma's had a terrible time on third down conversions after we bragged about how they did it last year. Here's third and goal. DeMarco Murray flanking Landry Jones in the gun. Jones to the end zone. Incomplete and a flag. Going to have a pass interference on Brian Logan. Well, it looked like he made a nice play with his left hand, but grabbed with his right Pass hand. Interference on a defense number seven. Foul was in the end zone. Ball will be placed at the two-yard line. That was Automatic. oh First so down. close. He still can't believe it. He thought he made a good play. Let's take another look. Left hand, good play. Right hand, hard to see from that angle. You might see it here, though. He was trying to get it out of the way. Oh. That looked like a pretty good play. I thought so too. At any rate, first and goal, Oklahoma. Trying to extend their three point lead. Play action. Jones throws, and it's broken up at the goal line by Pendleton. <laughs> well, they're not pulling any punches no. with their freshman quarterback, I guess. That's really great discipline by BYU's defense, because I would have thought with all those running plays, they faked the run on first down. This I would have thought this would have been wide open, but BYU read it and was not fooled. Second and goal. DeMarco Murray up the middle. Did he get there? Not quite. The officials both come in. They're going to spot him at about the one foot line, it looks. Romney Fuga. The nose tackle made the hit. You talk about a big third down. There's the head coach at BYU hoping for a goal line stand. It'll be clap the fullback DeMarco Murray the tailback in the eye. Oklahoma third and goal at the BYU one. Jones looks to the sideline to Josh Heupel and company for the call. He'll quarterback keep it. No signal. He's not in. Again, I don't like third down, fourth down, one yard, short yardage, taking all that time at the line of scrimmage. Linemen like to get up, snap the ball, and fire off the football. And, and this just helps the defense, I think. Everybody just took a big, deep breath in here, about 80,000 of our friends. It's fourth down and about a foot. Chris Brown back in at tailback. Fourth and goal. Again, Oklahoma has a look to the sideline. And now even Clapp they forgot get the, the play snap off. count. The play clock's done. Penalty markers delay a game, Oklahoma. Wow. Now they got a kick. 